Data visualizations are becoming more commonplace on smartphones and other mobile devices. People export timelines of stocks and track their number of steps in health apps. But as we display more data on these 1D visualizations, it becomes increasingly difficult for users to reliably select items because tab selection is imprecise and the finger occludes part of the screen. We suspected that people select more accurately with selection techniques that provide visual feedback during the selection. We designed an experiment with 50 participants to compare the accuracy between tab and feedback providing techniques and to learn which type of visual feedback is most helpful. For the task, we asked participants to select a target item, highlighted in red, from a vertical list of items. This is similar to common mobile selection tasks, such as navigating a vertical timeline in Google Photos. When users selected correctly, we displayed more items for the next task, making it harder to select correctly. When users selected incorrectly, few items were displayed. For the techniques, we compared the conventional tab interaction with three techniques with visual feedback. The tap and hold technique allowed users to preview which item would be selected if they stopped holding down their fingers, allowing them to correct the selection. The handle technique provided accurate positional information on where the selection would occur, similar to a mouse. And finally, the handle with hover technique combined the two types of visual feedback and provided position and item level visual feedback. Here are the results. For all techniques, as more and more items were displayed to participants, their accuracy dropped. The main finding is that the accuracy dropped much more dramatically for the tab selection than for any of the feedback providing techniques. At 75% accuracy, participants could only select the target item from 60 other items using tab, whereas they could select it from 176 to 250 items using one of the other techniques. That is a dramatic difference that validates our hypothesis that providing visual feedback allows users to interact with more data accurately. Within the three techniques of visual feedback, the handle with hover technique that provides positional and item level feedback performed best, but we did not find a significant difference in our hypothesis testing. For task times, users took about 1.2 seconds to do a tab selection and 1.4 to 2.3 seconds using the other techniques for a comparable range of task difficulty. For difficulties that were not reached using TAP, participants took up to 3 seconds using the visual feedback techniques. In summary, providing any type of visual feedback using drag-based selection techniques improves selection accuracy 3 to 4-fold and allows users to reliably interact with more data on a 1D visualization. This comes at the cost of a small increase in task times. The paper is available online as open source at osf.io slash spmv9. There you can also find our data and our analysis routines for full transparency and replicability. Thank you.